Since my mom passed away, I try to talk to my dad at least once, twice a day. So I called him up on the phone and, you know, I'm sitting in a parking lot at the gym. And, um, you yeah, know, we're just talking about uh, him coming out to vacation to see me. And a woman must have parked next to me. But there wasn't really room for her to get out. So she continues to just bang my door. And I guess she didn't see me in there. I was pissed off, man. I yelled at her. I guess eventually she saw me and scattered off. And then I thought about what I was thinking about. And I thought to myself, in the scope of life, why am I wasting my time being angry at some girl I don't know? I had gotten a note from a woman who went to Cortland State. She must have watched one of the Mikey Chronicles. The last one that I put up. And she said that it's hard for her to ask for help. She's got cancer. She's got children. And it just puts things in perspective, you know. As independent as you are, the people that love you, they would never mind going out of their way for you. They just want you to believe you're going to get better. Even though it's the toughest belief in the world, what other choice do you have at that time, you know? You got to believe. So for all you people out there fighting cancer, believe. And for all you people chasing dreams, nobody tells you you can get them. Look them in the eye. And say, fuck you. You can do anything you want. Be cancer. Go for your dreams. And be a good person. Have a great weekend. I love you. I'm a lucky person.